All right, we have a book, Herman, Herman Hubbard, and Ivis H, I guess. <laughs> uh, and this is a father and son. So the father is Herman. Uh, he is a Belgian artist who's amazing. This is a, uh, a Belgian comic, Blood Ties. And Dark Horse puts these out uh, with a, a group called SAP Comics to form Venture. And it's just one Belgian album like this. I didn't know this one came out, and I missed it. Uh, there's not really a great listing that is, like, comprehensive of everything that these have released or that uh, Herman's released in English. Uh, but it does get translated. I can't show this whole thing, because like many European comics, there's there's nudity and stuff in it. But we get, a, like, a mob situation. And this is a, a definite, like, crime noir story. You, I love this style art. It's super, uh, super moody, super crisp, and it, it reminds me a lot of the Jeremiah stuff uh, that he did before. And there's this guy; he's investigating this death, and he's a he's an orphan himself, and he's a cop uh, who's into that. And he gets caught up in this like very weird Inception-y like thing where like everybody's corrupt, nothing is what it seems it is. People are being hired as actors to. Uh, you know, play different parts for these mobsters. And there's this guy who controls the city who's uh, a big... I'm just making sure there's no nudity on these pages before I flip over. <laughs> um, <clears throat> and uh, there's a, a femme fatale who's an element of a part of this. And it's it's super tragic. It's super dark all the way around. I can't talk... There's not too much to talk about without spoiling this stuff uh, through the course of here. You can see just some more of the just brilliant figures and art here. It's just, uh, this is, this is true comic art at its best. You can see the, you look just the moodiness of the running through the rain. Um, the cityscape up here is just phenomenal. Um, it's, it's gripping and it's crazy and it doesn't feel good. <laughs> I gotta say, it's like everything, like everybody's corrupt and everybody's messing with this guy. And uh, it doesn't have a happy ending. It, it does early in the book tell you like that you should see his gravestone at the beginning of the book. So you know he's going to die. And it's just, uh, it it doesn't feel good, but it is a really well-crafted story all the way around from the writing to the twists. And there's, there's multiple twists in this crime noir uh, to the art. Um, so it is interesting. If you like crime noir and you want something dark, that has that like Sopranos feel to it. Uh, this is a good one to try to pick up. It's Blood Ties. All right, I'll give this an eight out of 10. Interesting stuff coming out of Europe. Uh, people really need to pay more attention to this stuff. We'll be back soon.